Big Z Reviews. I Am the Night is a mystery crime thriller based on a true story uh, set in Los Angeles after World War II, you know, about this this doctor that's a serial killer and, you know, everything that goes around with his granddaughter and when she tried to find out, you know, what her family, what her real family was and you know, all the mystery surrounding it and the actor, you know, the, the reporter that was surrounding it too. And, you know, I liked it. I found her. And that's not all. You remember that murder case? There's no information. You gotta remember where you are. Who runs this city? Some stories don't want to be told. Some stories will eat you alive. So I like the atmosphere in this show. You know, set in the you know, time period after World War II. And Chris Pine plays a reporter that's down on his luck. That, you know, has a little bit of PTSD from, you know, fighting in Japan. And, you know, Fauna Hodel, played by in India at Isley, who's really is a beautiful girl. And she has a thing where she thinks that she's, like, half black. Like, she's raised by a black mother. But she it turns out, like, she looks at her her birth certificate. And this is some... This, uh, this uh, Hodel is on it. It's uh, that she... So it's not her, who she thinks her mother is. And so that there is so... Like, she has to try to find out, like, who, who her mother was and who her grandfather was. George Hodel, played by Jefferson Mays. And goes to L.A. and finds out that he is not a good guy. And there are some thoroughly creepy scenes throughout this show. Although they're, they're, they're separated a little bit too much. Like, there's a little bit, you know, drama things going on and shenanigans. That it drags a little bit. Like, I wouldn't mind it being a little tighter. But I, when, it's, when it does the creepy things, I really liked it. I would have loved even more creepy stuff. And, but I think, you know, some of the stuff, you know, it has to stay relatively true to the actual story because it's based on a true story. So things have to happen in a certain way. I'm sure, I'm sure they also, like, they, they fictionalize some of it. But some things have to happen in a certain way, especially towards the end, which I didn't love, but I still really enjoyed. I really like the actor, especially with Chris Pine in India as Isley. And, you know, as a whole, I, I liked the show a lot. I didn't love it. Wasn't it anything like fantastic? At the time, it felt a little bit like a lesser version of uh, the True Detective. It didn't, help, it didn't help that those those shows are going on at the same time. Essentially, True Detective and I'm the Night. I think I'm the Night may have started like a week later or something, but like, they're going on around the same time. So I would watch on Sunday. I would watch uh, True Detective. But then um, Tuesday, whatever, when it came out, I watched this. And like, it, like when you have those two comparing them side by side, it was definitely the lesser of the two. But it's still, uh, I really liked it. I'd probably give it like a 7.75 or an 8 out of 10. It's a good show. It's, it's well filmed and well acted, well directed. Like, And I, I liked a lot of things they did with it, but it wasn't anything amazing. I definitely would recommend it if you like this style of like crime drama. But uh, thanks for watching it together. Please on my head and scratching that Z over there. Thanks. This has been a Big Z TV show review. Thanks for watching.